So what I see is you cannot put all incumbents into one box. 100%. You have, I think, three groups, like in the Premier League. You have some teams that always win, and I don't think we need to be, uh, I don't think we need to worry about the big players. But then you have the positive surprises, like mm -hmm. um, Lancaster, I think, winning the um, Premier, how, how do they call it? Leicester. 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 Yeah, yeah. Uh, that was yeah. fantastic. Eh? <laughs> you have the positive surprises, like Leicester winning the title at some point. But you also have the negative surprises, the former gigantic successful clubs and insurers that get relegated to second and third league. And, right. and what I see, especially in the field of positive surprises, that you have a lot of smaller insurers that out of some weird reason, sometimes it's cool leadership, sometimes it's a great advisory board or some great department leads suddenly um, or already are transforming and changing their culture or always had this um, culture that was different from like the, the, um, the large hierarchical culture.